Fight IG. It is Tuesday, March 29th, 9.30 in the morning. We are training back today. This is our first set. We did a light resistance band warm up and dumbbells. Good. We held the first rep for five seconds. And then we have 12 reps. Good. We're gonna hold the first rep here for five seconds. Then we got 12 reps. Pull and hold, hold, good, squeeze. Good. And row. Perfect tempo. Good, second set, we added tens on each side. We're gonna hold the first rep for five seconds. Good. And we got 12 reps. Good, squeeze right there. Hell yeah. Big pull? Yes. Yes. Big stretch. Good. Six more, go. One, a little bit faster now. Two, three, four, five, one more. Done. Good, I want 15. This is for the lat, for the serratus. This is so that when we're in our front and our back poses, we are wide. Good jet. I like doing machine pullovers after I've done plate loaded exercises. There we go. Good, 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 good. Finish it. Good. Put your feet up. All right, now eight. we're doing a triple set. We're doing eight on 135, eight on the 120, eight on 105. Back to back to back. This is in combo with machine lap pullovers. and weight we're gonna go down in reps by three so now we have a 12 rep set good jet Stretch, good stretch, good pull. Twelve 
12 reps. You got it? Finish strong. Finish strong. Oh, you gotta use the foot thing. Oh, swell, man. Oh, man. Stretching. <laughs> That's some stretch right there for you. Good, straight to it. No drop, I just want 12 reps on the heaviest weight we did last set. 135, no drop, just 12 reps. No drop, just 12, yep. Third and final set, we went up 10 more, or sorry, went up 15 more pounds. And we have 10 reps. So the first set, we did 15. The second set, we did 12. Third set, we did 10. Good. Yes, Jet. Don't forget to use the foot paddle this time. Good. Three more, three more. One, two more, bring it down. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, right, done. Use the foot. Yeehaw. Yeah, that's what I want. Good, straight to it, 12 reps. Good. And reset one more time. Good, and one more time, third and final. Good. All right, so we've done a lot of volume already. Now we're going to get into isometric holds. We are going to grab these weights and we're going to do a 20 second contraction of just holding the weight, squeezing our back, pinching together, and bring them up. Pinch, 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 higher, higher, squeeze, hold there. 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, set them down. Good, we're gonna do three sets of 20 second holds. Then we're going to do three sets of 10 reps. Now what this is gonna do, it's gonna make those 10 reps a lot harder, especially at the bottom of the movement. He's gonna be fried. Second set. Again, isometric contractions are very important for making the muscle contract for a longer length. Longer period of time. Good, and straight up, yes, yes, that's right where I want it. Boom, boom. Good, squeeze, 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 squeeze. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. This is our third and final set of our isometric holds. Now we got 10 reps, this is gonna be hard. We wanna get a lot of range of motion and get the weight up as high as you can from the bottom, so full extension, good. Yes, one, reps, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, one more, 10, done. That's how you want it, just like that. Turn around, let me get three back flexes. Two more. 
Open, open, open. Good. Right side's released, left side's still tight on that shot. Good. And back double. Good, and back relaxed. Good, straight into it, 10 reps. to do overhead close grip pull downs slide your hips in a little bit more there you go good the first rep we're gonna hold at the mouth one two three four five up a little bit one two three four five good big stretch then 11 more reps one bigger stretch there you go Second set, no holds on this set, just 12 big reps, big stretch, big pull. One, two, three, four, five, good. Big stretch, big pull, six. Feel your pinkies, feel your elbows. Drive that weight towards the floor, big stretch at the top. Done. Last set of this, I want 15 reps here. Pretty good speed and big stretch, good. Two, three, four, five, yes. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more. Eleven, drive those elbows. One more. Good. Turn and face the rear. Good. Turn and face the judges. Side pose. Good, hand on hip, core tight. Stay there. And face forward, both hands on hips, blow the air out. Good work. All right, what is up? It's Tuesday, it was a great day. It was a blessing. Every day is a blessing. Every day we have to take it for what it is and we have to make the most out of it. I look at each day as an opportunity, and today I had the opportunity to train Jet. We are um, just over nine weeks out from the Miami Pro, uh, June 4th. I have Francisco and Jet in that show. Francisco will be competing in the NPC as an amateur. Jet will be competing as a IFBB Pro men's physique competitor. Um, with that being said, today we did back. It was a great workout. Jet's an outstanding athlete. He's very strong. Um, he has good movement patterns. We did a very, very, very effective workout. Uh, we did resistance bands as our warm-up, as you guys already saw. Um, but what is special about Jet is the way that he's able to contract and the way that he's able to get his neuromuscular control to work. Um, the way he does his back movements and the way he trains just in general, his mind to muscle connection is something that I really love and that I really respect. And I wish 
all of my clients would work towards having that level of neuromuscular act activation. Now, Jet is very versed in the gym. He's a, he's a gym rat. Um, even if he wasn't competing, he's always been lifting. And that is why he's able to have the neuromuscular control that he has because the hours and hours that he has spent in the gym gives him that ability. Uh, I'm Our back workout today, I didn't want it to be anything crazy. It was very effective. And his movements were extremely specific towards where we are trying to work in his back. He has a very, very wide back. We need more separation and more density, or sorry, more separation and more striations. He has so much density. He has so much density. So I'm not really trying to get him that much bigger. All I want is for the illusion of size by making his muscles tighter and harder. And we're doing that. You know, he is doing an amazing job the way he is on his nutrition, the way he is on his training. I'm very proud of him and I'm very excited about what we're bringing to the stage. And, you know, every day he takes advantage of what's on his, what's on his training and his nutrition. Jet is so dedicated and diligent. I can't say enough good things about him, but I'm blessed and honored and thankful to be his coach. I do the best I can and he is a blessing to work with. So we are going to bring an awesome package to the stage in June. I'm super excited about it. Thank you guys for your support. Thank you guys for watching. Um, from this back workout, I hope people stick to the fundamentals. You know, we didn't do anything crazy. We did some drop sets. We did some super sets. We did some combo sets. We did some isometric holds. You know, those isometric holds are very important. And I, I recommend everybody to incorporate some of those, those movements into their routine and see and feel how their body responds different. So thank you guys for watching. Um, I'll be training Jet again in two more weeks. And then at six weeks out, we'll be training once a week together. If you guys have anything you want to see, let me know.